Hello guys and welcome to this week's game log and I have been working on the animation system this week and I've actually completely redone the animation system because the old one was kind of rubbish. Um, I haven't worked on the animations themselves yet uh, so they're still looking pretty bad but I have worked on the animation system and one of the things I've done is this the smooth movement between starting and stopping animations and between animations, different animations like that. So yeah, you can see the legs are moving smoothly back to where they should be when I stop or start the animation, which, yeah, stops the animation looking jerky and stuff. Also, I have two different types of animation now. One like the running animation, which just loops over and over again, and another like this, which just stops the animation when it gets to the end and it holds the last pose until whenever it needs to finish the animation. Uh, so that's pretty good for that jumping animation like you saw and maybe a falling animation where you wouldn't want the animation to just keep repeating as he falls if it's a long fall you'd want it to like hold there like that and yeah so I'm pretty much done with the animation update all I need to add now is the parser so that I can make the animations in Blender and then export them and then my f my uh, my game can read the file format that Blender exports them into and then my animations will be able to be a lot nicer and I will be able to make some beautiful animations hopefully and it will look a bit more realistic because at the moment it, well it doesn't look great does it? Um, but yeah that's all for this week, a bit of a short video but there wasn't too much to show this week uh, if you want to follow me on Twitter, you can see some extra videos there of other stuff that I'm doing during the week. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for watching this video, and I will see you next week.